Hi, I'm Lieutenant Engineer Greg Thomas. I'm USS Lake Erie's anti-terrorism officer. As you can see, I'm wearing a mask in accordance with CDC guidance. Uh, we'd love to have you aboard today, but unfortunately we can't. So we're gonna go ahead and take you on a virtual tour. Come on aboard. Welcome aboard the USS Lake Erie. USS Lake Erie is a Ticonderoga-class cruiser, CG-70, named for the Battle of Lake Erie, which happened during the War of 1812. It was one of the United States Navy's most decisive battles during that time. We're known for uh, Commodore Oliver Hazard Perry. He flew the flag, don't give up the ship, which was the words from his famous friend, Captain Lawrence. That being said, why don't we go to the pilot house and see how we drive this thing. Welcome to the pilot house, we also call it the bridge. Uh, right here you'll see our helm station where our helmsman and lee helmsman will drive the ship just like a car with a steering wheel. We also have up here all these windows, we can see where we're going. We also have radar stations just in case it gets dark or if it's foggy outside. Uh, right over here is where our quartermasters would be working. Uh, they help us navigate the ship by using charts. We always have several people up here to make sure that the ship's navigating safely. Let's go take a look at the boat deck. Lake Erie has two small boats. They're called rigid hull inflatable boats, or ribs for short. We have one on the left side and one on the right side. The one on the left is named Porcupine, the one on the right is named Scorpion. They're named for two of the ships that participated in the Battle of Lake Erie. We use these boats for search and rescue missions and for transportation from ship to ship, ship to shore, or any kind of other transportation that we might need. Now speaking of transportation, let's go take a look at the flight deck. On board USS Lake Erie, we can land and launch almost any kind of helicopter out there. But typically what we'll have on board is a helicopter called the MH-60 Romeo. We can fit two on board inside the helo hangar, which is right behind you. Typically we use our helicopters for search and rescue efforts, anti-submarine warfare, and also transportation, picking up and dropping off mail, people, and all kinds of parts. All right, this is what's called our aft missile deck. Right next to me, you'll see we have 64 of our 128 cells where we're able to launch all kinds of different missiles and torpedoes. Even further back, you'll see where we are able to launch our harpoons. Let's go take a look and see where our crew eats. where our culinary specialists work very hard to feed our crew three meals a day. When the crew isn't eating or working, sometimes we can come in here, hang out, play cards, do other things just to kind of bond together. Okay, right next to me is our medical facility where our sailors can be treated for a variety of ailments while on board. If there's anything that's more serious, we would transport them to either a larger ship with larger medical facilities or perhaps a facility ashore via, via our helicopter. This is the forward part of our ship, or what we call the forecastle. Right here you'll see our, the other half of our vertical launch system, one of our five inch guns, and ahead of that is gonna be our two anchors. The ship has two anchors, we only use one at a time, but it's always good to have a backup. Thank you so much for coming aboard, we really enjoyed having you.